Hi everyone, it's Wednesday, December 13th. Um, it was, uh, this will be, today I had my 30th radiation treatment, um, so I got five more to go. So next Wednesday the 20th I'm done. Uh, I have one more chemo to go, that's tomorrow the 14th. And, uh, and hopefully, you know, by next Wednesday I'll just be getting out and, and start healing. Um, not a whole lot has happened last week uh, that's any different. Um, things have just, you know, progressively gotten a little bit worse. You know, the, the side effects have, you know, um, escalated a bit. Um, the Right now, pretty much the entire inside of my mouth is, is solid red. Uh, it's, uh, you know, burned in there from the radiation, uh, irritated, swollen, um, mucositis. There's sores here and there. Uh, it, uh, it hurts to swallow like food a little bit, um, but mostly my throat is sore at night and in the morning. Um, so I take uh, Oxy and Tylenol overnight for that to help, um, and that does help help me get to sleep. Um, the, uh, what well, you can see, you know, my, my face is, uh, it just continues to get redder. Uh, you can probably see, you know, here, uh, where they, they really hit me with the radiation there, so that's getting burned. Uh, no beard, it just, uh, it's gone from, you know, I'll, I'll get, uh, you know, maybe down to here, but all this is gone, everything's gone. Um, I got a little bit left, excuse me, here and here, you know, that's it. Um, my mouth is still dry, uh, very dry. Um, and my mu or, uh, my saliva is really thick, uh, almost like a mucus consistency. It's kind of awful, actually. Um, and uh, I haven't had any trouble with mucus, though. Um, and, and I've read and I've talked to some guys that have had trouble um, with real thick mucus, but not me. It's not happening to me yet. You know, hopefully it doesn't. Um, and really... Uh, other than fatigue, which I am getting fatigued earlier and earlier, um, it's uh, it's about the same as it was last time uh, we talked. Um, but the fatigue, you know, it seems I'll wake up in the morning, I'll go a few hours, and, and I'm tired. I want to take a nap, but I just don't. I won't let myself do it. Um, after this, I just got back from the hospital. I had lunch, and now I'm going to uh, go to the gym. And I'm not laying down till tonight. I just, I don't know. I, I just, I think it's counterproductive to what I want to do here. I want to heal. I want to keep my blood moving. I want, I want to go. So um, I'm, I'll lay down tonight. Uh, I may lay down early tonight, but I'm going to lay down tonight. Um, so I still go to the gym every day, six days a week, um, other than chemo day. I give myself chemo day off. Um, you know, still moving uh, and doing all that. I'm doing okay. Um, as far as, as that goes, I'm doing okay. Um, so that's about it. Uh, and, uh, I'll talk to you in five days when this is over. And, uh, you know, and I, I, th I think I'm going to continually, what, what, what they say is that, you know, next week, uh, is my last radiation day, but anywhere from five to 10 days, five to no one week to two weeks after it could get worse. Like, the radiation keeps working. I don't know how that's possible. Um, I, I don't know. We'll, we'll see. Um, but they said it could get worse the week after. So uh, we'll, we'll see about that. I'll keep, you know, I'll, I'll keep doing this until I can start myself really feeling like I'm coming back. And then, you know, maybe less, more time in between each one. Um, uh, you know, so uh, during the healing process. But uh, that's all I got for now. Uh, thanks for tuning in, and I will talk to you next week.